A terminally ill man convicted of a brutal killing near McCall back in the 80s will stay on death row. This is breaking news into our newsroom. Today we learned Governor Brad Little denied a request to commute Gerald Pizzuto Jr. sentence. Pizzuto beat a man and a woman to death with a hammer near McCall back in 1985. Last month, Pizzuto's lawyers asked he be spared the death penalty because he was dying of bladder cancer and was no longer a threat. Idaho's probation and parole board voted 4-3 to three in favor of commuting Pizzuto's sentence, but the governor disagreed. In a letter to the commission's director, Governor Little wrote, quote, The severity of Pizzuto's barbaric, senseless, and indiscriminate killing spree strongly warns against commutation.